Hi, I'm Todd Harmon. I'm the president of Hallton. We're standing in Baltimore at the Druid Hill Reservoir. Here's the coffer dam that the general contractor put in place to help separate one half from the other so they can drain the right half while maintaining the water level on the, on the left half. I'm Scott Brinkerhoff. I'm project manager and vice president for Hallton. The city has a project to modify the, the drinking water lake and as part of that project they need a, a dam and we're lining one face of the dam so that they can drain the opposite side of the lake and continue the construction of those underground tanks. It's a little more grueling than a typical project simply because of the layout of the, the site and our access and uh, having to actually fabricate panels and float them out across the lake to get them in place. Typically, we're deploying the liner in a dry condition. Uh, in this case, it's a balancing act. We want it to float until we get into position. Then we need to sink it fairly easily. Um, the XR5 is, has a higher density than water, so once water is on top of it, it will actually sink. We, we're making it float now. We've built that perimeter around the sides and the floats on the ends, and we're telling it, you're floating. And then when we're ready, we'll drill holes in all the PVC pipe around the perimeter and then sink it. Weather can be a factor if we have heavy rains. We have pumps ready to pump the water off the top of the floating liner. If we had too much water sitting on it, it would start sinking prematurely. So the weather's a little bit of a factor in that respect, but uh, when you have a chance to do something a little different, a little unique, you know, as the project managers and office people, we, we like to see that too. So a little change. And the guys in the field, they enjoy it as well. We've done floating covers, we've done a lot of reservoirs, but this, it kind of pushes the limits of what we can do. Uh, something new and different. You add a, a large panel that you're floating out and then sinking in place. That's new for us. This is something that we can all go and show people, hey, you know where Druid Hill is. Well, we did that. We did that dam across there. We lined that.